what's up y'all it's your girl sass and i'm back with another one straight facts if you haven't already make sure you drop those comments down below subscribe to this channel make sure you hit the bell on the side to get notified when i post and last but not least make sure you like this video up like this one the last one the last one and the last one before that do those steps for your girl so as you guys can tell by the title i am doing a prank on my daddy he in the other room right now i gotta talk a little low because he might hit me but <clears throat> I'm gonna use my camera to set it up in a room because every time he know I me, mean, every time I get ready to prank him, he always looking for my phone. So I'm doing this intro on my phone, but I'm gonna set the camera up. And um, <clears throat> and um, y'all about to see how this prank about to go. Um, I hope it go as planned. I'm gonna try to see it though if I can how the way I can set it up, like if I can get like a good angle, uh, so y'all can see his face reaction and stuff like that. But stay tuned. Like I say, you, you, you got a few that you, you, you bring close to your circle, but you don't let them in your circle. And that's it. You got a few that you, you know, use to your advantage. Yeah, so I really want a child. But I can't get, I can't have a child right now. Because I'm in school. You listen? Yeah, I can. Well, yeah. But, so how would you feel if, okay, but it's still having, it's still like having a child, but how would you feel if I be somebody surrogate? Because, yeah. well, me and Smurf was talking about it, and I really wasn't like into, into all of that either when I, I thought about it. Yeah. Let's stay rich. <laughs> Let's stay rich. <laughs> <laughs> but what if what if I already have an appointment signed up to play like counseling? You ain't gonna need to be nobody sorry. You know what I'm saying? You 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 don't even mess your body up right now for no for nothing. You know what I'm saying? You're not gonna get and then you you won't be somebody sorry and you ain't never had no child. And you see that child and they came out of your womb, you gonna fall in love with that child, you're not gonna wanna give him up or her up. And then you gonna be trying to, you know, you gonna be near gonna give be in the ceremony. And you gonna be trying to raise a baby. And you ain't even got your career started at all. You ain't got nothing to offer, you know, from the gate. Mm -hmm. So, you know. You gotta at least um, went through at least one or two childbirths before you consider being somebody surrogate. So it won't be that bad on you when you, you know what I'm saying, when you have a birth, birth a baby and they automatically gonna bring bring the baby that you see in or her. Mm -hmm. And you know, you fall in love with that baby, it's over with. And you don't want to give him up, but see, you don't do a contract, so I think, well, you got to let it go. Mm -hmm. And it's going to kill you because, see, you ain't never had no child. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Yeah, I was looking at the qualification. It's yeah, not with a the good idea. Hmm? It's not a good idea. Yeah, I know the only, the only thing that I, that it, it, that is saying that I don't have, it's a be currently raising a child or children. Right. Know. See, I already see, I already got my ticket to go to Atlanta. Like, it's in Atlanta. I already no, no, see it's right here. I don't, I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You don't need to be trying to be nobody Sarah, your mom. You know what I'm saying? Leave that shit alone. You see, that's what I'm saying. Y'all do these secret things, and it's going to affect you more worse than it'll 
it'll affect anything in this world. So it'll affect you all. Knowing that you don't gave birth your first child, you don't gave him away. Mm -hmm. And yeah. then, and then when that kid get older, and he gonna want to find his birth mama, he gonna ask, well, "Why did you do that? Mm -hmm. yeah, what, 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 what was wrong with me? Why you want to give me away?" See, that's not a surrogate. A surrogate is the 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 daddy putting the sperm in. I know people. it. I and know that's, it. That's they that's they child. It ain't my child. Yeah, but you carried that baby for nine months. All right. So it's supposed to be well. The child didn't know who his mama is and all that. His biological mama. It's supposed to be the child never finds out who. His biological parents is, but nowadays that shit's so easy to find out that you know you can't hide it. All right. So he come back to you when he came grown and doing his thing, and be like, "I just wanted to meet you and ask you why did you give me up?" All right. And then what you gonna say? That was a contract. He paid for that. No. Don't mess your life up trying to be somebody's surrogate mom. You know what I'm saying? You finna mess your life up because, see, number one, you, you don't have to be on a library. Right. Because you don't know if you're not finished with school, you don't have to go to school. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You don't have to go to school. You don't have to go to school. You don't have to stop what you're doing and, and, and taking care of your pregnancy until you, you know what I'm saying? After you finish that, then you will pursue your. Career no. Don't do that, baby. Now, get yourself established. Stop worrying about a baby or being somebody's surrogate. But I want one. Yeah, but you won't want to give away. Yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? You don't want man to raise on your own. You got you know what I'm saying? Once you get your life started and you start making money, you get your own career. And you know you you want your own kid and you if you ain't had man by you know, with you and your nigga, you know what I'm saying, then you go and, and uh, get yourself injected however you want to and have your own kid and raise him or uh her. -huh. You know what I'm saying? Don't sit here and try to be nobody's surrogate mama and then you don't you know, mess your, your, your life up trying to please somebody else. No. I don't care who talked to you about that, who told you this. <laughs> no. <laughs> because this is your life and your body. And you don't need you don't need to do that. Right. So it's my life and so I need to find another question. True. You you do, but I'm giving you some parenting advice that you really need to take heed to. Because you, have, you know, it's not. <laughs> it's not right. It's not right because it's your, you know, your life you messing with. It. You say, okay, you decide to do that, and you ain't got but another semester left for school. You know what I'm saying? You gotta let school go to carry the damn baby that you're not gonna even keep. So I can see if you, uh, you know, your dude had a child together and he gonna be supportive with while you finish school. You know what I'm saying? That, hey, it's like I was trying to tell her. She was like, she don't wanna work at Windows. She's tired of standing on her feet all day. I said, y'all have enough school education. You might can't be a full or nursing aide or a social worker. I said, but you can work under the umbrella of that. You know what I'm saying? Until you finish school. And like I always tell y'all, I got y'all to where I'm where I you know, make y'all comfortable with y'all self. You know what I'm saying? First, I made sure I introduced y'all to 
a bright place. You know what I'm saying? So you can get that college feel, that atmosphere. And and then when you graduate school, you know, I, I had a plan. Shayla was gonna be at Grammy, you were gonna be at Silver. Mm-hmm. So I got a boyfriend and dad, I don't want no way up there. <coughs> so I said, fuck it. And then you got, got out of school, you know, you was angry. Either, whatever you want to call it, <laughs> to go to school. And that's what I wanted and that's what I liked. And now it's almost over. You know, miss your life for trying to have a baby for a set of your parents. And, uh, mm-hmm. Until they want to find out someone else. Because you about to finish your career. Yeah. But, well, I'm going to still go meet with him and see. But. <laughs> I'm going to still. You don't maybe even do that, Sasha, because they're going to try to convince you to, to go through with everything. You don't even need to do none of that. I'm telling you, baby. You don't need to sit there. And I told him my day. He made a lot of things clear to me that this ain't what I'm ready for. So I thank you for your offer. I thank you for everything. But no thanks. You know what I'm saying? You he ain't want that life, so he ain't, he ain't ready for it. Because it's, it's a lot just doing that. It's a whole lot. <clears throat> they gonna be trying to watch you 24 7. Make sure you ain't trying to bring no harm to the baby. Mm-hmm. Make sure you eating healthy. Oh, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, wow. Mm-hmm. I'm just doing a rest meal. Huh? You just doing a rest meal. You be somewhere on Saturday morning. I was talking about this. I'm so sleepy, I can't even keep my eyes open. Yeah, I <laughs> mm-hmm. So, Frank, I just wanted to get your reaction. <laughs> Stop playing with me, dog. <laughs> I just had to get your reaction. That's a lie. <laughs> get the hell out of here, Sasha. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you stay tuned for more lit content. Um, it's more on the way. More on the way. I promise y'all. Just bear with me. Bear with me. Because I'm trying to do this vlogmas thing. I've been. I think I missed a day and a half. Uh, a day. But um, make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to Life of Sassy. Make sure you tell them come join the plus gang, gang, gang. Um. Bye. I love y'all. Yeah. What? Alright. Uh, Three cups. Gang. Uh, I got.